And that company belongs to Denny Hamlin. Then you've got Jimmy Johnson a long way back to Clint Boyer, Matt Kenseth, and Dale Earnhardt Jr. They're all trying to run down the Aaron's Dream Machine. Mark Martin at the front of the field. Mark breaks up off turn number three, heads to the start-finish line. Here's Joey Logano dropping low, looking for a chance to pull alongside. Seems to have the horsepower. Can he make it stick there? Logano on the charge, trying to make the inside move on Martin into turn number one. He can't get there. Tucked right up under the spoiler. Martin is loose. Logano. Moves him up out of the groove, and they're side by side now. Logano slides to the inside of the racetrack. Joey Logano takes the lead off turn one. Logano goes to the point. Mark Martin there trying to regain that lost ground in second. And if those two don't look quick, here they come. Tony Stewart sails in the wind for that mobile one Chevrolet. Jimmy Johnson now slides by Denny Hamlin. It's a five-man free-for-all for the win at Tokono. They are nose to tail. The top five are Joey Logano, the first one back to turn number three. He's got two car lengths over Mark Martin. Now just one car length back to Tony Stewart. He continues to close. To get down to the line, there will be three laps to go, three laps more, and it will all be over. It is still Joey Logano ahead of Mark Martin by some four car lengths. Tony Stewart, he is the man making up some ground and dragging Jimmy Johnson to the front with him in turn one. And now it's Joey Logano beginning to show some strength after wrestling the lead away from Mark Martin. He's opened up by three, maybe four car lengths. Then it's another five back to Stewart, two more to Jimmy Johnson, five more. Denny Here's up the long pond straightaway. Joey Logano in command. Mark Martin now having some work to do to get up there to retake that top spot across the tunnel turn. It's Logano by three. Logano by four. Joey leads the way to the turn three. He is beginning to drive away. He is beginning to pull away. Joey Logano opening up the race lead here at Pocono over Mark Martin, over Tony Stewart, over Jimmy Johnson. It's Joey Logano showing the way. He pulled out to a one-second lead over Mark in that last green flag run, and now he's building on that once again. They cross the start-finish line. Six-tenths of a second, the margin from Joey Logano back to Mark Martin with two to go. And it is rapidly becoming bye-bye Joey Logano. He continues to pull away from Martin. Tony Stewart, now he's got a back bumper full of Jimmy Johnson, as Johnson looks to get into the top three before it's done. And Denny Hamlin now begins to fade in the stretches uh, here at uh, Pocono Raceway. Jimmy Johnson, fourth. Tony Stewart, third. That battle tightens. And Mark Martin, instead of challenging for the lead, he could be challenging to hang on to the runner-up position. And that's because those Toyota taillights beginning to grow ever smaller for Mark Martin as he watched Joey Logano drive away. Advantage now for Joey up to 10 car lengths and growing. Mark Martin, second. Tony Stewart, third. But here comes Jimmy Johnson. Here they come down to the line. White flag being waved to the leader. Joey Logano, as he takes it back into turn number one, he has an advantage of eight-tenths of a second. But for Mark Martin, Tony Stewart, and Jimmy Johnson, that's all up for grabs in turn one. He's fought off one of the best in the business to get to the point in what could be a career win this afternoon at Pocono. Final time off turn number one. It is old Joey Logano in the Home Depot Toyota. For the final time up the long pond straightaway, it's all orange. It's all Joey Logano. That Home Depot Toyota sets up for that final run across the tunnel turn. He's blowing them all away. Pulling away from the field is Joey Logano off turn two. Joey Logano blew away the track record here just a day ago, and now he's going to blow away the field. He put the car on the pole. Here comes Joey Logano. The final time to first turn number three as the race leader. Joey Logano off turn number three. His only other Sprint Cup win was in a rain situation at New Hampshire. Today, it's all guts. He did it. He made it happen today, winning the Pocono 400. Joey Logano gets the win, beating veteran Mark Martin to the line. Tony Stewart will finish in third. Jimmy Johnson gets fourth. And Denny Hamlin finishes in the fifth position. Let's go to pit road. Absolutely pandemonium down here. The very last pit stall just before you go back on the racetrack. Jason Ratcliffe, the crew chief, being mobbed on top of the box. We'll let this team celebrate. They've got a long way to run down to victory lane. And we'll be going down to victory lane to visit with Joey Logano. We'll also hear from the other top five finishers when we come back to Pocono.